Hey guys, welcome to the channel and this is a guide on the latest event we just got on Raja that's fishing. Uh, please note this is just from my first time, my first experience with this event. So if there's any other tips or tricks I might get from this after making this video, I will drop them in my comments community section as a post there or make a video about it. So if you haven't subscribed, please hit the subscribe icon. I hope this video helps you in understanding this event. It's gonna be simple. It's just about, I think a six minutes video. So anyway, thank you for watching. Enjoy the video and yeah, let's start with the guide. So the first thing you want to know is how to get to the event's location. Um, you just go to your event, time limited, and goes down, you say fishing contest. This event is only available on weekends, on Saturday to be specific, from 1 p.m. to 10 p.m. server time. So you just have to tap on the join and it will take you there. You only get experience, gold, and a fishing chest, which you will gain automatically about five minutes into the event. Anyway, when you tap on the join, you take you to this location in Castle College. There are two NPCs here. The first one teaches you about the rules and gives you the certificate. Do not collect the certificate first, okay? That's the one and most important thing you want to know about this guy. Basically, it just tells you about the ranking system and the rewards you get from this event. So if you want to, you can read them here or in your own gameplay. The second NPC talks, well, it doesn't really talk, it just gives you bait. <laughs> so there are different types. The Dying Earthworm and the Freshwater Shrimp Bait help you catch freshwater fish at Castle College, Fun Fair, and Hydras. The second set include the male warmth bait and the frog leg. These two helps you catch sea fish at Chiziru, Siberia Harbor, and Lily Gold Island. These two are separate from the first two, so take note about that. Now the final one is the type 21 crab bait and the broken magnet. The crab bait helps you catch crab, shrimps, and mollocks at all areas. There's no restrictions. While the broken magnet helps you catch coins and cans at all areas. Now you see the differences amongst them. So for this video, I actually took this one, the type 21 crab bait. Um, yeah, maybe next time I'll experiment with the others. <laughs> What you want to do is uh, make sure you have more than enough of the item. You see, I came back and I bought an extra 99. So I currently have 198 of the items. All right, so now you can come back to the first NPC and collect your certificate. Why I said you should take the certificate later is because immediately you start or immediately you collect the certificate. Yeah, it has a timer on it, 15 minutes. So you see, it's already begun. The countdown has already started. So you have 15 minutes to start fishing. And if you have no idea how to go about this, all you have to do is go to um, your inventory right now and search for the bait, the bait you bought. So this will help you to start fishing quite fast. Just look for the bait, say mine down there and select it and tap use. It will take you to any of the location that is available stated on the bait description and it will take you there and start fishing immediately. You remember the bait I bought is the one that can be used at all areas and it helps me with crabs and shrimps and mollocks. So right now it's taking me to one of those areas which is Lily Gold Island. And yeah, <laughs> now you, once you get to the fishing point, all you have to do is tap on the fishing and select the bait you have and want to use. And that's it. Don't rush to go AFK, okay? Cause it's going to have a prompt after this first fishing. And all you have to do is confirm this, and now you can go AFK for the remainder of the 15 minutes, okay? <laughs> you can go AFK right now. Um, know that you must have more than enough bait. Why I say you should get that is, apart from the time spent, you are going to burn through a lot of those baits, a lot of those laws. This is because your line is going to be snapping most of the time, so whenever the line snaps, that's a failed fishing right there. I've not really fished before, so <laughs> this is kind of different for me. Now you get different grades of fish while fishing. The green grade will give you three points. The blue grade fish will give you four points. The gold or yellow grade fish will give you five points. And finally, the red fish or red item that you see I got gold coin will give you 50 points. Uh, now, I don't know if the points will differ based on the fish or item you get, but for the color, they are kind of basically the same points all around them. So that's what you gain from this event now, you get points. When you start fishing, the first few minutes you get this item, the Fishing Master Pack. It's kind of great actually, it gives you all this reward, so it's not bad. <laughs> Alright, so now I have finished fishing. 
my first ever experience with it now to exchange your points you go to your inventory and change right here and you see fishing points are down right there so you see i gained 286 points from fishing now you can this is based on luck actually you can get more than this and you can't spend your way through gaining more points so this is not a pay to win event guys this is not a cashing event okay <laughs> It's just RNG. You can get all these items from exchanging your points. So please don't miss out on this event. It's 15 seconds, oh, sorry, 15 minutes of AFK. Now, this is why I said you should get 132 bits minimum. Because you see, out of my 198, only 66 was left. So that means I used 132 for this entire event. And that is all for the fishing event, guys. Remember, it's only on Saturdays. 1 p.m to 10 p.m now what i'm not yet sure of is does the weather affect the fish you gain or how much fish you gain and does the bait as well that you use affect it and in that case which of the bait and which weather is best for fishing so these are things i will figure out as we keep doing this event and i will give the explanations to you in the community section or make a video about it now i hope this video has helped you guys understand how to fish and everything about the fishing event now i'm pretty sure i might have missed something but whatever i have missed you can lay it down in the comments and i'll cover it either in another video or i'll respond to you right there or i'll just make a post about it in my community section so again please leave a like to this video if you've enjoyed this if this has helped you don't forget to subscribe hit the subscribe icon there for more content about roger more guides and tips and tricks and I will definitely deliver. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Love you all and I'll see you in the next video. As always, take care guys.